What's up guys, CJ here for Kung Fu Night. It is time for more. It's always sunny. What's up? Last time we had Frank's episode, he is the Warthog, they were calling him. So, started a company, it got really huge, and he sold them out, right? We had a lot of weirdness from Dennis last episode. Oh, gosh, what was it? He impersonated somebody. He... Really, really enjoyed doing that. There's sexual stuff in there for him with it all, too. Um, you know what? Someone had a comment. I'm actually going to read this comment. He or she wrote this. My general read of Dennis is that he follows the pattern that... I think. But I'm not a doctor, so please take with a pinch of salt. You would typically see in people with pathological narcissism, where he's deeply insecure, feels empty inside, so in order to feel okay safe in the world he constructs a false grandiose self and invests in it to the point of delusion the thing about that is he then has to be constantly propping up the per persona because there's nothing underneath it if the persona cracks then he's faced with the reality of himself which for someone like dennis is unbearable this is why he reacts so violently when his solutions are challenged for example the high school reunion episode the idiot savages rant about the frat boys for Dennis, I think his persona is mainly based around two things. One, being sexually attractive, and two, being intellectually superior to others to the point that he can effortlessly manipulate them. So, with respect to this episode, I think what's really getting him off here in, in a most sexual way is a huge dose of validation for his persona. He's successfully manipulating the shareholders into thinking he's Brian Lefebvre? Lefebvre? And also, in a sense, manipulating of himself into being and doing whatever he wants this reinforces his grandiose perception of himself as a brilliant puppet master which makes him feel great short version manipulating people makes him feel powerful and special and this feeling excites him to the point of orgasm apparently without and so that, that that's the, that wraps it up great thought but that last point that that's what i was so confused about um right because i mean you have the class the classic Know, terminology getting off someone's aroused and all that but I, I i didn't me i didn't understand how he could get sexual gratification from what i was watching unfold which was carly or whoever it was outing dennis as not being who he was at the end but this whole episode dennis was impersonating ryan and i think that makes sense right he's manipulating someone Brian by being him and making him do whatever he wants in a way um and I know the world's a crazy place and all that but like like fuck <laughs> uh I don't know what else to say about that but yeah so let's see what this episode has in store we are where we are with this show so <laughs> let's enjoy the ride leave your comments down below links in the description for patreon tiers I am not gonna waste too much time Get right into it. Hold still, Charlie. You're flickering. Yeah, sorry, it's I'm trying to get you good image. Just keep getting shocked a little bit. Charlie is a dirty man. Work. I had to run the wires from the other building. No building in the, you know. Oh my god. Asbestos in the in the ducts, which wasn't good. Good for breathing, so I'm tired. <laughs> watching this crap. Come on. There's nothing real about this shit, Frank. You know that. Come on. Real women don't even look like that. That is what real women look like. Oh, I haven't had a chance to shower for a few days. I've been gaming like a loon. You've been what? Gaming. I've been gaming. playing this online video game. It is awesome. Charlie, speaking of which, you want to come play my avatar for me for a little bit while I run some errands? No, nah, I'm kind of busy working for the guys, dear. Like, this. Shit. You're our employee. You do what we say. I pay your rent. Do not drop those wires. Everybody wants Charlie to do so much for them. He's like subservient to everyone. Shit, screw it! Son of a bitch! But I'm getting sick of this shit, I really am. I have potential, you know? King of rat. I can go places, I can do things. I might even rule the world one day. The rat rule world? The world, huh? Yeah, if that happens, I'll blow myself. Well, Dennis is gonna blow himself this episode. Okay, so it's called Techpocalypse, right? And we're post-apocalypse, and we have to rebuild civilization. And this is me zinging QD23. Whoa, 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 slow down. <laughs> Zinging Beauty 23. Are you pretending that you're 23 years old? You know what? Just watch over my tribe. 
and make sure nobody, uh, you know, takes it over. Okay. And I'll give you your money. Okay. okay? What is that? That's you. You're one of my subjects. <laughs> See, Max, my handmaiden. How do you do? <laughs> and Dennis is a midget blacksmith. <laughs> Frank oh is my a god. This is our and world. You're my jester. You've been playing this game for like a week straight just so you feel like you lord over all of us? Is that what this is? Charlie, do you want your five bucks or not? I really do need the money though. Yeah, Can you get, well, then get in to work. advance? No, not in advance. We'll see how it goes. You're paying this man heavily this. below minimum wage. What's up the music this episode? We in the 80s? That's what I'm talking about, guys. There's nobody else in the, the bar. Middle dancing. of the day. We're setting the tone, Frank. You know, we will lead and others will follow. This is the I'm middle stopping. of a work day. Look oh, at the couple people they're wearing. All right, let's, hey, uh, bartender, three shots of whiskey. Come on. I know you guys. This is you, right? This this is Frank and, and Mac from Zing and Cutie Strat. What the hell is this? This is D's online video game. Okay, I'm just starting to piss me off. Stop getting invested in fake realities. Come on, do it. Do the shot. I'll do the shots. I'll just do the shots. How about that? <laughs> Oh. Oh, my God. oh, that caught me off guard. Okay, you know, I tell you what, Carl, let's settle for a seat. <laughs> we'll call it a day on that. I got to run. Zing Cutie 44 is back. So. What the hell are you doing, Charlie? I told you to just feed my crops. I did. I fed your crops, and then I gathered some rocks, and I built a little wall around your tribe. Then I used leftover rocks to dam the river so that you could fish. Now you're doing well in the game. Dude, what'd you get in the store? I bought a smartphone so that All I can play the game on the go. What's going on with the fingernails? Well, I had those done like Flojo. Why? Oh, shit. Charlie, you got me 31 new followers? Yeah. That's amazing. I always get at hey, this. Hey, do you want to maybe team up? No, because I don't want to be a slave. It's like when I'm doing good in the game, I'm doing good in life. Nah, but I kind of know what you mean. It's like I'm thriving. You're thriving. Yeah, I did feel that. You and I, that? I did. I felt that. Just accept my request Are you gonna to it? consummate. <laughs> consummate. What is that? Have sex. In the game. Yeah, I'm <laughs> sure. Yeah, you... <laughs> either way. Slow push and you do your thing, or a little circular just push enters. The button, push, just push the button. <laughs> <laughs> you see me, Frank? Love it, you see Charlie. Me coming? I see you. I see you. Oh, here comes another guy. Look at Mac. Mac attack. Look at Mac. Fight. Fighting is the best part. It's oh the only. Oh my God! Will I'm you guys playing. please shut up? I'm hungover as shit. We're playing Tech Apocalypse, and I am a gorgeous girl. Like, I'm a real housewife. Look, Dennis, <laughs> I, I'm six foot More ten. real housewife references. Hey, Frank loves that. You're five foot nine. And Frank, you're a man. An ugly old man. I think I have something that can help you wrap your head around it. Is he supposed to blow himself this episode? I've never had my hair cut in a bedroom. You don't have to go to a high-end salon to get a high-end salon quality cut. It's just so much preamble. We need to... Okay, here we go. Oh. <laughs> Just pushes her head down. <laughs> Dennis, how does this make you feel? I'm very aroused right now. I too am aroused. I'm starting to swell up. Yeah. It's all a virtual experience. No, no, no. Bullshit. Yeah, this was real, okay? This happened. I did this. I'm going to go out into the real world again today and have real experiences. I'm going to draw those people in to me, okay? A turtle's dream. That's crazy. I've got a new nose, and I'm flying to Miami to get my lips inflated. Can you hang on one second? Yes, fine. Buy your lips, buy your noses, buy whatever you're gonna buy. All right, don't interrupt me when I'm running our tribe, okay? Because that's kind of a big deal. I know, I'm sorry. All right, so don't interrupt. Okay. Hey, bitch! Frank, you are Sweet Peaches 69? <laughs> How did you get so many followers? What can I say? Some girls are more popular than others. <laughs> I'm getting a lot of gifts lately. I'm living a pretty classy life these days. Oh, you should come to my party. I'm gonna meet a lot of my online friends there. <laughs> Well, look, we could sit here, we could talk cheesesteaks all day long, but maybe you and this I This man is mired in felt. Charlie, all we gotta up. talk. Whoa! We're going to a party. Charlie is doing well. Frank's throwing it, and he humiliated me. I'm a queen, okay? I should be the one wearing mink, and I should be, you know what I mean? I should have a lot more followers. You want, you want a nice, real mink coat? You know, not a virtual one like Frank? Don't dick around with this. Are, I'm are dead serious? serious. I, you like that, yeah, wouldn't you? Yeah. You know how that's not gonna happen? What? It's not gonna happen if I'm not playing the goddamn game! People are attacking our tribe, okay? We could lose everything that we have worked for. Everything! I wasn't thinking. No, you're not really the thinking kind, though. I'm kind of the thinking one in the relationship. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Charlie, Charlie, we're seeing a whole new to. side of Charlie here. <laughs> well, well, well. If it isn't the soiled fool. <laughs> Frank told you about that? I did win, I did win. It just got a couple of good shots Hey, Charlie, in. hey. Yeah. You're not gonna offer our guest any? Look at those energy Of course bars. I of course, that's what I was doing. Yeah. 
Hey, Mac. Eat one. Hey, did you did you want an energy ball or two? And stop graveling. Let Just, me know if you need you know, You're not pretty when you do that, so. Charlie wow. is really kind of like totally dominating D like here. Annihilated her. Can you watch her for a little while while I go meet a girl that I met online? A real girl? Yeah, a real girl. She's probably fat, right? Fat girl? Is it she's fat probably girls? very fat, yeah. Likely a fat girl. If she's got any fat friends, I'm, she I'm in there. If fat friends, I'll let you know. Do what I'm asking, and then I can help you out with the game. This man just said he hates women. Hello? Hi. That could make sense with, like, how Mac has Hello? Hi. behaved. Enter a new dimension. I've been in a sensory deprivation tank a few times. It's pretty relaxing. What even is reality? Oh. This is real. Uh, How do you do? Oh, we could be in a turtle's dream in outer space. Is this real? Am I? Who are you? I'm you. <sighs> He's cutting his own hair. That's an what? amazing accent. I like yours as well. Everything in life is becoming more and more virtual. If you believe it to be the real, Australian? then it's real. It's my choice. I <laughs> literally am God. Oh. <laughs> Great timing. Julie, right? The second most powerful player in the game. And you are the mighty rat slayer. Tis I, tis rat I. slayer. Start. Wow, this is it's cool to meet someone from the game, you know? I brought you something. You did? It's nothing really. It's just um the best cheesesteak in Philadelphia. <laughs> I got you something too. You know, I, I don't want I don't want to make you feel weird, but here, just a box of spiders. <laughs> What the hell? What the well, while fuck? we've been sitting here, my followers have burned your land, they've raped your people, and they've destroyed your tribe. I just wanted to have lunch with Dude. you. Dude. Bullshit! You think I'd give up all <laughs> this for lunch, you stupid fat pig? I'm not fat. My friend Max said you'd be fat. Whatever. You're a dick. And you're yeah, man. Like dog food. Oh! I got the power now! I well, really missed opportunity the there. You could have been happy life. there. You said this was a classy affair, Frank. It was a classy affair until you showed up. <laughs> <laughs> He's better at the things than you. Ah, Corella. Right, nice. See, give me your phone, give me your headset. I gotta get back online ASAP. I just made some big things happen. Big things, baby! She's not with you anymore, bro. I know you were gonna leave me for the Queen of Thrones, so I've slept with Mac to humiliate you. <laughs> oh my god, D. You stupid idiot. Do you, do you have a brain in your head? I was tricking that girl so that I could destroy her tribe. We're the most powerful tribe in the whole game now. What are you doing? You know, I I guess maybe I hadn't really thought the whole thing through. He did say that You're he's just the thinker. <laughs> housewife, okay? Zing it, girl. Frank, yeah. shut the hell up! Everyone, get out of my apartment, okay? No, not you, not you, and not. Had a lot of fiery Frank, Charlie shit. this episode. A lot of fiery yeah! Charlie. I'll let you live, all right? But Mac and Frank, you gotta give me your shares of Patty's Pub. Done. What? This game. Has gone on long enough. Uh, Charlie, you think you have all the power? Well, you don't. You see, the only thing bigger than a king is a god. I'm the one who's thriving, Dennis. I mean, look at me. You look like you're covered in a Hawaiian bunch. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I am the god of my own universe, Charlie. I unplugged it. Me neither. I just, I, I deleted all of your characters from the game. Oh, I erased all your people. How, how did you do that? Well, it was easy. You guys all have the same password. Patty's pub. I think this could be like related to like kind of what CH was saying too. Everyone was checking out of real reality and investing in the game. They weren't, I don't know, validating Dennis by being around him, and he feels powerful when they're they're around, right? Just by pushing them around or doing whatever else. But so yeah, I think that led to his desire to want to delete other characters too. Force, try to force all of them to be back in. Sometimes things just sort of end. Oh, they were talking about a turtle this episode. This was a weird episode. Yeah, wild episode of Sunny here. Everyone got invested in Tech Apocalypse. Frank, I don't know why I can't get him eating those peaches out of my head. That was absolutely disgusting. See, I want to, one thing I want to roll back is. What they were talking about with all the turtle stuff, they were in the pub, and when Dennis had his coming to Jesus party, or I don't know, seeing himself as a god journey in the sensory deprivation thing, the turtle just keeps like, what the fuck is up with the turtle? <laughs> 
I have that question. But yeah, we did see Genesis God Complex really surface as he wanted to manipulate the gang out of the game. Definitely a surprise. Like, I, again, I like how, like, nothing's off limits here. This is something completely out of pocket for the gang. Like, they would never really fuck with technology, like, in the online gaming realm. You, you wouldn't put it past them, right? Or you wouldn't expect that of them. But, but yeah, here we are. Like, we're progressing. He got a smartphone, so we're seeing more stuff like that. Social media this episode. We're seeing more stuff with that this season. Social media and... Like online gaming stuff like that yeah wanted to check out of reality and just you know immerse themselves in the game gang it was funny seeing how their their tendencies surface in the game i keep wanting to say gang funny seeing how the tendencies surfaced in the game as well a uh, mac you know making a huge character he wanting to be younger again for attractive probably was good at it Charlie was truly good at the game. He was wheeling and dealing out there and, you know, had a, had a potential, I don't know, love interest. He seems to have a type, you know, with Caroline being a blonde as well as the girl, queen of, queen of, queen of something for the two of them, right? Seems to have a type. Yeah, I mean, I think I'll leave it at that. I do like how we are, again, breaking new ground in different topics. Yeah, really good episode. Leave your comments down below, links in the description for Patreon tiers, and I will see you next time.